theory that I go to. My account has been frozen. I just unfroze it, but I downgraded it to, I think they call it the elite, but that just means you can only go to eight classes a month. Before I had the premiere, I mean, sir, you see I'm trying to get on this freeway and I have nowhere to go. Um, it's just people. Um, before I had the type where you can go as many times as you want, unlimited and right now I'm downgrading because a their schedule is not as flexible as I need it to be B the trainers that I like no longer are really heavily scheduled so we're gonna see how it goes um, so I'm gonna go back on Friday I still have to wear a mask when I go there so I need to get some disposable masks and then starting June 15th they just put something on their Instagram account where they will offer mask free classes and classes where masks are required and you can kind of book according to your personal need so I did that um, I woke up this morning did a 45 minute hip-hop class with tune day attempted a 10 minute arms workout but I had to take several pauses in there did an ab workout put my laundry away and that's that I'm feeling better today than I did yesterday I went to bed and I think something that I have to do is have some sort of schedule that I'm going by and I know I mentioned I was going to put myself on a schedule but I don't have anything set in stone and that should help I think yesterday I had no schedule at all I was an off day I didn't work out I don't know and I think some of it's just hormonal so uh, I need to develop a routine I think a routine keeps me sane but this is at the place that I was getting my nails done before the pandemic shut everything down I don't want to get too excited because the person that normally did my nails there is not back yet so I'm going into this manicure blind I don't know who's doing it I don't know their skill set um, they all seem to be pretty talented when it comes to nail art but it's still someone new so I have a idea or two as to what I want my nails to look like but they also have like this board of options that I always look at when I get there so we'll see so I'm I'm cautiously excited that I can go back to having a more elaborate manicure and get my nails back on track because that was the place where my nails grew because I was getting this protective layer put on my nails and that seemed to work so just about home I'm about to go inside I'm gonna take a shower because I just washed my face and put my eyebrows on to go run these errands because I just want to get those done. Take a shower, eat, and do a little bit of work before I head out to my manicure. put you guys down I'm getting ready to leave actually I'm getting ready to head out oh no I forgot something for my manicure but I also am going to be stopping at the mall I believe because I want to exchange some makeup items so there's a Mac store on the way to where I get my nails done and with the Mac store if you trade in 
like six empty containers. You can get a lip gloss for, not, not even a lip gloss. I think it's just a lipstick for free. Maybe a lip gloss, but also an eyeshadow. And there's two eyeshadows that I definitely need. One for my brows and one I use as a base. So I'm heading back upstairs to pick up these makeup items, these empty containers. I think the bag is busted, so this should be interesting. I'll just take this whole thing downstairs and pray for the bag. Um, so, yeah, I'm getting these makeup items and then I'm getting in the car and I'm heading out for my manicure appointment. And then I'm going to stop at Megan's house because she lives very close by. And if I understand correctly, she's gonna order us some dinner and we're just gonna hang out for a bit and then I'm gonna come home. But um, I did, I think when I got home, I ate, got a little work done, sent out an email that I need to send for leadership, got all the application materials linked up, got the auto dialer recorded and sent that to my administrators and ask them to send that out tomorrow. And then I took a break. I'm currently watching some episodes of Girlfriends because I almost forgot that I was in the process of trying to get caught up on that. I am now in season five, episode three, and that's it. And other fun news, surprise! <laughs> I have another handbag in this color. I bought this one probably in January. In the, in the years to come, this will be what I carry in the springtime, and the yellow will be what I carry in the summer, but I got the yellow, and then it was spring, and I was excited to carry it, and then I bought this. I literally have one for every season now. There is one more to be debuted in the fall, so there's that, but I gotta go. I don't wanna leave too late. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. finished up my manicure it took two hours and 15 minutes here it is um, I don't know if it's gonna focus really well it doesn't look like it's going to but I'll show you when I get home uh, so she did a good job it was a little stressful because this is a, a preset design that they have on display and so I don't know if she like normally does designs but you can tell that she was stressed trying to make me happy and trying to replicate it so I at one point feel like I was sweating because I felt like I was under pressure to make this manicure happen and that we were doing God's work. like it just was stressful she was stressed I was stressed but she did a good job it came out nice um and so yeah this is one of the things I splurge on these manicures are expensive because they are hand painting all of this on here and so I normally would make an appointment right away like when I finish I'll make another appointment three weeks later but I couldn't do that because she wasn't even sure if she would be there in three weeks and then the other person that I normally went to they're like she might be back in September so I don't know where she is and what's going on um, but I'm just happy that they're open because this girl did fine and then the other lady who appears to be the owner I'm certain she'd be able to do these designs um, so yeah I got gel builder put on my nails which is something that just strengthens them because my nails are super soft like inexplicably soft to the point where they feel like they can't file my nails so I'm heading over to Megan's right now. She ordered something from California Pizza Kitchen. Um, so I'm going to drive over there. I don't know if I'll vlog over there just because I just don't know. But I'm just so excited that my nails are back. So I wanted to show them to you. And now I need to go. All right, I'm home. It is a little after 10.30. I went to Megan's house. I obviously didn't vlog at all. We just hung out for a couple hours. We had, I don't know if I told you, we had California Pizza Kitchen. For dinner, I tried the carne asada uh, pizza for the first time. It was very good, and then we just talked about 
stuff. Um, but I'm trying to see if I can show you my nails up close. I really do like them. You know, like I said, it was a stressful time because she seemed very nervous and I was nervous because she was nervous and all of that, but they came out really cute. Megan liked them. Her husband also liked them too. He saw them as I was leaving. He was arriving. So here they are up close. This was one of their presets, meaning that this is an option that they provided. So all of that was done by hand she did a great job and so that is what my nails will look like for the next three weeks or so I'm starting to feel like life is somewhat normal because that has come back those manicures have come back to my life it is something that I splurge on and it just makes me feel good about myself I get my pedicures somewhere else where it just doesn't really matter as much so um, I'm gonna close the blog here I have to go edit <laughs> and I want to read some tonight. Um, I had a much better day today than I did yesterday, and um, I'm thankful for that. So if you enjoyed today's vlog, please, please give this video a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do that. And if you are not following me on Instagram, head over there and do that. You can find me under the name Smarty Style. Big surprise. And as always, I hope that you're well, and if you're not well, please be well, and I will see you guys tomorrow. See you then.